Hello, I'm Marcus Lai, installation and heating engineer with the company Hubert Maurer in Gottenheim, southern Germany. Today I'm going to show you how I use the Testo 320 to test a mini cogeneration plant. I attach the measuring instrument with the help of the magnets on the rear and connect the combustion air probe and the flue gas probe to the measuring instrument. I then switch on the measuring instrument and it begins calibrating. I open the appliance in order to be able to measure the gas connection and flow pressure with the Testo 510. To do this, I close the gas cock, remove the screw from the measurement connection, and attach the measuring instrument to the measurement connection. I switch on the measuring instrument, open the gas cock, and see a connection pressure of 24.8 millibar, which is an acceptable value. In order to be able to measure the gas flow pressure, I start up the system. The system is now running and I see a gas flow pressure of 22.6 millibar. This value is absolutely fine. I now carry out the flue gas measurement with the Testo 320. First I select the flue gas menu and select the fuel, in this case natural gas. I then insert the combustion air probe and the flue gas probe into the respective test ports and start the measurement. I stop the measurement when the appliance has been running at full load for two minutes. This results in the following measurement values. A CO2 content of 8.33 percent, CO content 2 ppm, which is excellent, a flue gas loss of 0.6 percent, resulting in a degree of effectivity of 99.4 percent. If the degree of effectivity were to get worse because of lack of maintenance, that would have a negative effect on the annual heating costs. In order to document the measurement values, I print them out using the wireless infrared printer. I have just explained to my customer that his system is working perfectly. Thanks to the Testo 320, I was able to test this quickly and efficiently. Its easily legible colored display and simple operation make the measuring instrument especially practical.